having a good morning. I have a totally different setup right now. Um, I have other stuff going on on my drafting table at the moment. And the paintings in here I know wouldn't fit on it like they normally don't. So I decided, you know what, I'm going to grab my card table. I'm going to use it um, for today. So it won't be a norm. I don't like when you guys can like see other stuff because I feel like it's distracting. I don't know, but I got my lovely fan going on over here because, well, it's summer and it's hot. But um, we aren't going to pay attention to that stuff, right? We're going to look at this stuff because that's what y'all come to see. All uh, right. Hopefully, you guys will be able to see um, a little bit more of the painting with this table though because this table is uh, longer than my drafting table obviously it's a card table okay you guys I got two um, paintings in here one old one new and we are gonna go with the new first actually normally I would go with the old first but I'm going into this new one. I'm going to actually take this plastic cover. Okay, that is funny. The old one doesn't have a plastic covering on it. Okay, it's not that old, but jeez. Okay, that I don't really care as long as, you know, nothing's damaged inside. Um, then all is fine with me. So, um, you guys have might have seen this one. But I don't care. I am so excited about this one. It is um, one I've been kind of waiting on. And uh, I know some other people. Uh, one of my subscribers specifically that is was waiting on this one. Um, so now she's going to have to go over and grab it. Okay, so it is a square. Um, and that's all I'm going to tell you yet right now I'm gonna get into the um, we'll get into these drills in a minute oh with my other table I have like a hidden space right here that I can put it on okay I'm just gonna put them on the ground for now new setup it's all different okay so um, just in case you haven't seen one of these kits before diamond painting uh, from diamond art club you get a tray throw that down pen tweezers not gonna throw those bunch of um little baggies two little adorable wax hearts a uh, squishy squishy and this one comes with a three placer now the reason these, this one came with the tweezers is because like i said it is a square um, I did like that they decided to go back to um, this plastic because the other one, the opaque one, like tore really easily. And I always put my paintings back in this one because I don't do them right away. So what I am going to do, guys, is pause you so that I can roll this the opposite way so that we can flip it out and see it together. So. I gotta walk around my table this time. Okay, pause. Okay, pause. I did not look at it, even though it was super hard not to do, but here we go, you guys. Here we go. Is she not, like, so beautiful? I mean, I cannot get over this one. Um, she is absolutely gorgeous. Now I'm going to do like a, I'll show you, um, over the top here in a second, but I, this one is so gorgeous. This is, um, obviously Ariel. Ariel is my favorite, um, princess. And, uh, my favorite part about this is her eyes. You guys, her eyes are so, so so gorgeous. I mean, I can't even, I just, yeah, we're going to go, I'm going to show you it like closer up here in just one second, but as always, um, canvas 
super, super sticky, you guys. Um, don't worry about these creases in the actual plastic. Um, it is the pour glue method. It will not affect the canvas. It is just in your plastic. Um, so if you get one, don't freak out thinking that you're going to have a damaged canvas because you absolutely will not. So, um, I am going to tell you the logistics of it and it is a 57 by 77 centimeter square with a bees. Okay. So that is. I mean, isn't this, this is, they did so well on this, so well. Um, I just, I love everything about it, but the circles up here, I mean, let me see if I can, so that it doesn't glare since the sun's shining. Um, but look at these circles in the, the blue. They're just absolutely gorgeous. Now, you know, so one thing that I'm liking about this setup is that you can see the whole painting. The thing I'm not liking about it is I don't feel like you can see it as well. Like, even though you can see the whole thing, I, I don't know. I don't like how you can't see it as well. Um, I am going to pick up my camera here and show you just a little bit better. So I'm just going to tip you over so that you can see her face because look at her face. Look at her eyes. I mean, look at those eyes and her hair and just everything. This one is just absolutely stunning. I cannot wait to work on this. Now, the other thing I love, look at the detail in her tail. Like see all the tiny little, um, the white part. They make it so, like, it's just so detailed. I love it. I love this one. I am like, I just can't get over this one. This one is, I actually saw this one um, unboxed by Stitcherista um, as a sneak peek. And when I saw it, I was like, I have to have it. I have to have that one. Um, and <clears throat> so... It went to like the top of my list and she came today and I'm so excited. I have one that I'm working on right now. I always do this too. I know you guys, you all do it too. You have one you're working on and you got to finish that one. And then I had one like that I was going to do right behind it. But then you get one that you just get and it's like you want to start that one right away. I know you all do it too. Um... Okay, so we're just gonna uh, put that down like that. And if my kitty would get off of my drills here. I love my cat, but he brought a mouse into my house today. I had to chase him around because he had it in his mouth. And then I had to bring him outside and make him let it go. He wasn't very happy with me. But, um, I was not going to have a mouse loose in my house again. Because that cat, he's something else. Alright, I'm going to actually take him out. Sorry, I know I did not warn y'all on the crinkle. I apologize. Um, so, of course, there's got to be a lot of reds, a lot of greens. I mean, it's Ariel, come on. And of course, you're gonna have 310s because it's Mandy Mansano. So, here's your 310s, all of those. <laughs> a lot of different color. Actually, these are all the same color reds right here. Ooh, and then you got 666. Six, six. It's such a bright red. I really like that red. Um, keep going. This is like a Christmas green right there. Evergreen looking greens. And yeah, we know there's going to be a lot of greens. Um, because, well, like I said, it's Ariel. And one of my favorite colors is green. Um... My house is decorated in green. 
because I can't do it in pink because my son and my husband would probably move out on me. So, all right, let's go with these. This one's like a, like a nude almost. Man, they are so... These drills, you guys, are something else. They're like absolutely perfect. And they're gorgeous, too. They're really, really shiny this time. I'm not sure what it is, but it looks like, it almost looks like they have like a new, like a gloss on them or something. I don't know. They're gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Darling. Oh, beep, beep. Babies. 141, which is probably the most common, I would say, ABs. But you know what? It's like still so gorgeous. I love the white ones because they give that like rainbowy effect, you know? And you can really see the rainbowy effect on the white ones. So I love them. 820, one of my favorites. Uh, more ABs, the greens. Which, I love this one. This one they had in the, um, the, uh, Princess and the Frog one. And I loved working with them. They are so pretty. So pretty. Let's see. Hopefully you guys can see how gorgeous those are. Um, my favorite colors. Coming up. 3846. That's it there. If I can get it in the camera. 3843. Keep going. This one's that one's a really pretty blue too. I don't know what it is, you guys, but these colors, they're like, I don't know, they seem brighter and more beautiful. Oh, oh, we got another one. We got three ABs in here, you guys, and it is blue. Come on. Look at that blue. Seriously. That is going to make I mean, I already love the blue circles, and I can guarantee you these are going to be in those. And it's going to make those shine so much. Um, I cannot wait to see this one. There we go. All right. Got one more row here, which we got more 310s. We only had, we had three, four, four packs on the other one. And we got another four packs right here. So a total of eight packages of three pens. Um, but that's not unusual for, you know, Mandy's paintings. And I work on her paintings. Pretty much have one going all the time. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. You know, I'd love to see um, an orange AB. That would be really pretty. Um, I'm sure they're in their you know in one of their paintings i don't know i haven't seen it but i'm sure they have um before i put this one to the side i just want to show you guys again i know this is absolutely blows my mind every single time i know i've unboxed them before with these in them but i still i'm just like so excited about it um i don't have a sticker maker and these just make my day like this is they're starting to put this okay this is the inventory obviously which is a newer thing for diamond art club um but now they're not only putting the inventory in with this absolutely gorgeous picture right here which is you know fairly big and then they have down here their little logo and their diamond and this whole thing you guys wait for it wait for it is on a sticker it's on a sticker. So you, you know what I do? I cut out this, boop, 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 and put that on um, on one of my, um, like I'm probably use Harbor Freight for this, and um, on top of that storage container, and then on the second one, because this does have 39 colors in it, which I didn't say before, but I'm saying now, so as long as it's in here, right? Okay, the second storage container I would put this the aerial um, and the logistics of it so that way I knew which one would go to and I always keep this too I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with them but I am gonna do something with them because it's a sticker and it's a diamond and it's diamond art club so yeah and then I would cut these out and put them right on top of each stored container so I'm not wasting my labels or using my handwriting either. I get to use them. 
So I think that is like absolutely amazing that they're doing that. Hopefully my camera will focus for you. But yeah, so I love that. I absolutely love that. They, it just proves that they listen to their customers and you know, they go one step above and beyond. Um, and I'm gonna put all of these back in their packaging, but not while I have you on, um, on the video. So let's put this beauty away. And I will, as always, take a picture of it and put it in the end of my video um, so that you can see the whole thing. Okay, guys, the next one is um, one that has been, uh, I don't even know when it came out. Um, I really don't. But I, it's been out of stock for a long time. And I've been watching for it. And so, um, yeah, it got moved up to the top of my wish list very quickly. And then now is here in my home. So, um, same kit except this one does not have the tweezers because it is a round. So, because this, even though it's an old one, it, um... You know, it was out of stock, so they reprinted it. Therefore, I'm really hoping it will have that um, wonderful, wonderful sticker. So we shall see. Okay, so this one does not have a sticker, but that is okay because, you know what? I'm assuming that this one, um, yeah, so this one was packed in April. And um, they were not doing the stickers back then. And on the other thing is, this one was, um, it had the plastic off of the box. So maybe, I don't know, maybe it was opened, returned. I don't know. All I care about though is that it's in my house and it's not damaged. That's the only thing I care about. So if it was open before, oh well. Oh, well, because it is, looks, you know, yeah, you can't tell it was if it was, so, and, you know, not having a sticker, I, I still absolutely love their company, I mean, I loved them before they came out with the stickers, so, I don't know, can you guys guess what this is, just by the little bit that you saw, um, it is Camella. And she is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I love her. Now, it would be great though. I didn't roll it because, well, I don't know why. Typically I roll it backwards. I Actually, I did roll it backwards. Man, I literally had just woken up not long before and was starting to work on my Whip It Wednesday video um, because I had a little bit more to finish on that. And then I started working on it when my dog started barking because someone was at my door at 8 o'clock in the morning, um, which I'm up by then usually, but my kids are gone. So, um, anyways, it was the mailman, which I'm always welcoming of the mailman when they bring Diamond Art Club to me. So, um, anyways, you guys, this one I have been wanting for a while. Um, it is just, it's absolutely, be I don't know, I just love the ones with the girls' faces and their hair. Um, those ones are, I particularly, I think, am gravitating upon, but I loved my Mandy Benzano. I would love to own all of her um, Diamond Art Club pieces at some point, but um, right now I'm happy I have this beauty. So look at her face. She has a gorgeous face, gorgeous, gorgeous face. And then I love her blue dress down here and the roses that she's holding and that are around her um the whole thing is just absolutely stunning i'm going to once again i will pick up my camera and show you what she looks like more up close uh, this one is a uh, 55 by 83 and it is a round and it does have ab's um i believe it only has one ab's from the look of it but we'll see 
So there she is, you guys. Look at that face. And her hair is uh, the whole thing. They just did such a good job with this one. Um, now, I know you guys can see those creases, and that's what I was talking about before that are in the plastic, but they're only in the plastic. They are not in the canvas itself, so it does not hurt the canvas, so do not worry about that. Okay, I'm going to put you back down here. I'll be gentle. There we go. Okay. There is 44 colors in this beauty. And I believe I only saw one AB on there, but every once in a while they throw me for a loop and put one on the end. Nope. Okay, we're good. We only got one AB in this one, which is fine. You know, there I love the ABs, don't get me wrong. However, their diamonds are so gorgeous that they they're so sparkly. Even without the ABs. So, let's take a look at what we got here. Now, I wonder why they do this every so often. They put one in there that's singled with the gold space, or the gold letters, numbers, whatever it is. Yeah, anyways, um, if I pause you, it's because somebody's going to be walking by here in a minute. I can hear them. And if my dog starts a yapping, I'll just pause you and then come right back. But we'll see. He's conked out in his crate right now. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. Here we go. Start right there. You got a runaway right there. See that? Yeah. But it's just, you know, sometimes that happens where usually it's from the color before or if there was a color after. So, and then we got one cut right in the middle and it got literally like, it's in pieces. Um, yeah, my cat is trying to catch, I don't even know what it is. I think it's an outside bug and he's in the window trying to catch it. Baseball. Ooh, pretty pinks. Oh, that's a really cool color actually. I really like that. Huh, okay, we'll keep going. We'll keep going. Pink, pink, pink. Blues, blues. Okay. On to the next. We got your three tens, which is one, two, three, four. Four bags of three tens. That's not too bad, actually. Um, the last one had eight bags in it. So, and then this one, the 938. It looks like chocolate, doesn't it? I don't know if you guys can see that well in the camera, but seriously, it looks like chocolate. Um, Jack, quit. Quit, Jack. Hi. He's trying to sharpen his claws on my leather bench. Which is really annoying. He's already ruined my one side of my couch. Um, so, yeah. Anyways. All right, guys, there they are. Those pretty white ones I told you about, the 141. There is a lot in here, which means that this is probably going to be scattered around the whole painting, um, which is going to make it amazing. Now, this is not 310, but it's, you know, it's one of those, like, might as well be kind of ones. It has a little bit of a brown look to it, but it's very dark. There's your milk chocolate right there. Six, six, six. I don't know what it is about this red, but it looks so bright all of a sudden to me. I mean, it's always been a really beautiful color, but they in this in these particular canvases, I don't know. It looks so much brighter than it did before. I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm in the sunlight. I don't know. We've got some runaways here, guys. That's all right. I just fixed them. This is one of the colors I'm really starting to like. It's 3801. It's like a fuchsia. It's in between a red and a pink. And it's very, very pretty. Burgundy. And then we got some kind of ugly colors. But you know what? When you get these ones, it's funny, even though they're ugly to me on their own, when you get them in the canvas, in the painting, they all become absolutely beautiful. So... Anyways, 
So, you guys, I literally just got these in the mail, like, I don't know. Let's see what time it is right now. We've got 25, I'm, I'm into 25 minutes here on my video, so I got them probably like 26 minutes ago. Um, they came. As soon as they came, I literally like went, opened my curtains, went and got my card table, put it out, set my camera up, and I'm on. Because, well... <sighs> I got to make it right away because I want to open them right away because I have absolutely no patience, like no patience at all. Um, even though I can't work on them like right now, like I would love to, um, I still have no patience because I want to open them and I want to look at their canvases. Um, as always, I didn't do this before. Sometimes I get a little scatterbrained. I think I should have like a little like log of the order of things I should do them in. But as always, Sticky, sticky canvas. I mean, it's Diamond Art Club. They, they're, they don't disappoint. They really don't disappoint. Um, and yeah. So, all right, guys. I will um, with both of these um, for Camilla. I will put the price down right there. And for the other one, I'll sneak it in there because I didn't say anything. I forgot about it. But and I will take a picture of both of these at the end of this video so that you can see them whole in their glory and beautiful as they are. So thank you so much for watching you guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday. And even if it is cloudy and kind of crappy weather, like it is here today in Spokane, make it a beautiful one and keep on shining. Bye guys.